Ah, Deuce Mason joins us live from Sacramento. He's checking things out. Hey, what's up, Deuce? Hey, good morning, guys. The Art of Toys in Sacramento is absolutely awesome. What I love about it, the theme this month, Monsters and Dragons. Ooh. It changes every month. Let's talk to Terry. She's the owner here. Terry, tell me about the concept here. So each month we change it to a different theme and we local artists do paintings that match and then we have artists that do their art in the form of toys or they use toys to make their art. So these characters that you were shooting here, these are Thomas Copian out of New York. They are sculpted in um, styrofoam, then they're rubber. So then it's pulled off, stuffs and paints them, and they're here. So they are a work of art, but they're also a toy. They're puppets, right? Well, that one is. Look at this. Look at the detail in this. And what's this guy's name, you know? Uh, Gilbert Grape. Hey, hey, it's me, Gilbert Grape. What's going on, guys? <laughs> anyway, yeah, some really cool pieces of artwork here. And yeah, some local stuff as well. Um, yeah, inner child in the adult, yes. and uh, obviously you got it there. Okay, I, we before the break we were showing off the finger puppets over here and the incredible amount of detail on these. Talk about these. These are made with polymer clay. It's Dan Crowley out of Chicago. Every piece, every color is a different piece of clay, and they are finger puppets, but they're also wonderful little sculptures for your desk or your bookcase, and. Um, he does commission work, so he'll do the whole family as well. That is so cool. So you could send him pictures of your family, and he would actually make yes. finger puppets out of it. All right. Then we're making our way back here. Some of the uh, local work that you were showing off. These look so cool. And a local artist did uh, these, right? Chris Cinder, and he's kind of got himself a little spot here all the time. But he does. These are card stock and then painted. They start at $15. I have kids collecting them. A lot of people have many of them on their desks. And then he does these wonderful one-of-a-kind original acrylics and um, sports family of five, and he just loves to do his art. Okay, what's coming up next month for those who want to come check out the Art of Toys in Comics Sacramento? and Sci-Fi will flip over this weekend. We flip over to it on Sunday, so it'll open next week. Okay, and people can check out your website, too, because you sell a lot of these items, of course. Yes, it's artoftoys.com. And, um, and then what happens is that we buy toys that support whatever the show is, and that becomes the back assortment and becomes the website. So different themes every month. Definitely a cool place to come check out with some amazing artwork, guys. It's the Art of Toys in Sacramento. Back to you. That's wow. awesome. And they're all puppets, too. That makes it really cool. Thanks, Deuce. Love it. Love it. We'll see all kinds of magical creatures in the Forbidden Forest. New at 8, we're going to check back in with